Shalom. Kahala Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and elders of GMS. Peace and blessings to the elect. This is GMS Stop and Listen, uh, GMS Arkansas. Uh, just coming with another quick, you know, lesson, man. Just trying to pump these, uh, this truth out, man. Best of our ability, you know, because time is uh, nigh, man. The time is nigh. Things are happening, you know, around the world. If, you know, if you're not paying attention to the alternative news, man, the Lord is visiting the earth, you know. In uh, this scripture is Luke, the sixth chapter. The subtitle is the house built on a rock. Verse 46, and why call ye me Lord, Lord, and do not the things which I say? Because you got a lot of people, they always say, I believe in the Lord. I believe in the Heavenly Father. And they always screaming, Lord, Lord. They screaming it with their mouths, right? They are acknowledging the Lord and his authority. And But it says, verse 47, Whosoever cometh to me and heareth my sayings and doeth them, I will show you to whom he is like. Right? Because they quit to say, Lord, Lord, with their mouth. But in their deeds, they don't uh, obey the Lord. Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai. They don't, they don't, um, you know, they don't, the actual commandments that they were taught, they don't observe them, you know. They don't observe, they don't observe the ordinance and the statutes and commandments, right? They don't do the will of the Heavenly Father. But they quick to say, Lord, Lord. He said, whosoever cometh, whosoever cometh, whosoever cometh to me, and hear my sayings and do them, I will show you to whom he is like. So he said, whosoever cometh to me and be his disciple and his follower, right? He says uh, to him, and hear my sayings, right? To pay attentive to the uh, doctrines and the, and the uh, mandates and these precepts. He said, I will show you to whom he is like. He, to, uh, the man that do that, he he is like the wise man. Verse forty-eight. Verse forty-eight says. Verse forty-eight says he is like a man, which built a house, and dig deep. Right. And laid a foundation, upon a rock. So he dig deep to lay that foundation. He worked at it, right? Because when you build, when you dig deep and you build on a rock, that foundation is gonna be what? It's gonna be strong. And only a wise man would dig deep to get to the, to the rock, to build his foundation on that rock. Because that rock is solid. That rock is gonna hold that, hold that structure up or whatever is being built. And it says, he is like a man who built his house and dig deep and laid a foundation on a rock. And when the flood, and when the flood arose, the stream beat vermily against the house. Right? Beat vermily, meaning it beat and dashed against. It was a tempest. Right? Burst upon. It was a, it was right beating fiercely it says the stream beat vermily upon the house and could not shake it for it was founded upon a rock so that storm that storm is representation of like Satan man when you build your foundation on your Habashim Yahushai which is a strong foundation he is that rock that we build on Satan is going to try to throw you off. He's going to send storms, which are what temptations, right? These are temptations and persecutions towards you to try to knock you off that foundation. Oh, you how about Shem Yahweh Shai? That's how Satan works. But if you're building your house on a strong foundation, like the wise man, when Satan come at you with these persecutions and temptations and these other doctrines, these false teachings, 
you're not going to be able to knock you off that foundation, man. Right? <clears throat> and it says, verse 49, But he that heareth and do not, do it not. So he that heareth and do it not, you pay attention to the word, but you're not a doer. Right? You sit back, you're hearing it, you're like, oh, yeah, whatever. You know? It says, he is like a man without a foundation builds his house upon the earth so you don't have that strong foundation you're basically building your house in the sand and when the water comes what happens to the sand the sand can be moved so when the when the flood comes in the persecutions and the temptations come in that that sand is easily moved so if you're building your house on that foundation of sand you're going to be easily shaken to or fro man you're going to be taken by the uh, persecutions and the temptations and the false doctrines you'll be taken easily by them and that's how you see that that brothers who came in the truth they and you seen them uh get kicked out or they just can't handle it they leave the truth they they built their houses on sand and it says but verse 49 he that heareth and doeth not is like a man that without a foundation built a house upon the earth against which stream did beat vermently and immediately it fell and ruin and the ruin of the house was great so the destruction of the house is great to a point it can't be repaired and that's how two-thirds do man they come in the truth you know the lord show them this truth and then they leave for what for whatever reason y'all by shimmy i was shy and it's all his his plan his purpose he have them leave for whatever reason he have them leave for that they can't stay in because they build a house not on that solid foundation y'all about shim y'all shy in the scriptures in the in the right doctrine right they come in with this false doctrine they're easily led by these temptations and persecutions of these other doctrines want to mingle other 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 doctrines in with it so they're building a house on the sand so they're going to be easily taken if you build your house on the strong foundation, how about Shimmy Al Shai, the storm won't be, the storm will beat up against you. It'll beat against you constantly, but it won't be able to knock you down. You'll be able to stand firm through it all, man. You know? And with that, man, I hope that's just edifying. It's, you know, the house that's built on a rock, man, that strong foundation is how about Shimmy Al Shai. That's the foundation you build your your, uh, your your house on, man. And, and we are what? We are the temple. We are that house. So, that's, so with that man, you know, all praise be how about Shimmy I was shy, double honesty, the apostles, the elders of GMS, and Brock Thumb all you Akin that's out there on the four corners, pushing this truth, man. Hey, build your build your foundation and y'all about Shimmy I was shy, that strong rock brothers. Hey with that, Shalom.